Listen to the following talk. A costly lesson from buying a one terabyte memory card for 59,000 Vindian. I thought I had hit the jackpot when I purchased a memory card branded by a major tech company with a one terabyte capacity at an unbelievably low price. I'm someone who travels a lot, so I take a huge number of photos and videos wherever I go. My 256 gigabytes phone doesn't have enough storage space. I was planning to buy a hard drive to transfer data from my phone. While browsing through an e-commerce platform, I saw a product recommendation. A one terabyte, one terabyte micro SD card for phones, said to be made by a well-known tech company. The price would surely please any buyer, 59,000 VNDs with free shipping. I had some doubts wondering, why is it so cheap? So I went through thousands of comments below and they were all rave reviews praising the product. That gave me some confidence in the purchase. While checking, I noticed that other memory cards with just 32 gigabits of storage were priced at several hundred thousand VNDs. I shrugged and thought, I'll just buy it. Maybe memory cards are cheaper now and shops are marking up their prices. Then the order arrived. The memory card came in a plastic box, which looked quite decent, so I felt more at ease. I immediately inserted the card into my phone. The phone recognized the memory card and showed a capacity of one telabytes. At this point, I was sure I had gotten a great deal. So I transferred my photos and videos to the SD card to free up space on my phone. The files transferred completely. But just a few minutes after the transfer, my heart sank. Every file I had moved was corrupted and there was no way to recover them. At that point, I went back to the online order, digging through the heaps of comments and finally found someone saying, I bought this to use with my home security camera, but it didn't work at all. I knew I had fallen into a trap and nothing could be worse than losing all my data. It was a very costly lesson for me. But the real issue here is, why are counterfeit products pretending to be from major brands being sold so openly? Where did all those glowing reviews for the memory card come from? Is this not a deception of buyers? This content is just an example for learning English. Thank you for watching. How do you feel about this video? Please leave a comment below.